Hi, I'm Crystal Hart and welcome to the show. We're in Spanish Harlem in New York City where Miguel Cotto and Austin Trout announced their upcoming fight which will take place Saturday, December 1st. It's at Madison Square Garden. It's a world title clash and it'll be broadcast live on Showtime. It's something I've, I've thought about and dreamt about for a long time. So, you know, to say dream come true, it literally is. Um, the garden is one of the biggest places I've ever been in, and the atmosphere in that place is just amazing. So, so to be able to fight in front of that type of atmosphere, you know, it it gives me the chills just thinking about it. I'm super excited, man. Well, I'm gonna show them who I am. I'm gonna make my presence very known, and my plan is just to remove all doubt of why I'm here. You know, they call me Austin No Doubt Trout because when I leave the building, you know, there's gonna be no more doubt why I'm champion, why I'm gonna stay champion, and why I'm gonna be multi-time champion. We are with the champ. Champ, uh, coming to New York City, Madison Square Garden, what does that mean for you? I mean, you, you said that you've gone into house of territory, but you've never been to Madison Square Garden. True, true. But, you know, like I said, the path that I've taken is all led up to this. I've, I've been in hostile territory, hostile waters. It hasn't been at this big of a scale, but I feel like it's just practice for this event right here. Champ, when that uh, opportunity arose with fighting Miguel Cotto, how would you take it? What you say? I light up and said, yeah, I got this guy now. Well, I, I wouldn't be so excited if I didn't think I could win. So as soon as they said, you got Cotto, I said, that's what I needed right there. That, that opportunity on this type of stage, that's what I needed to, to get into that gate of superstardom. Once you make your statement, uh, are you ready to let well, know who Austin Trout is? Yes, sir. That's why I'm here. That's what. That's the whole reason why I'm happy about this this opportunity. Because they will know who Austin Trout is. Thanks a lot for your time, Curtis. Right, thank you, man. Can I ask you, you know, Miguel Cotto, he's fought in fest from Mayweather down. That must be somewhat intimidating. So what's the more difficult for you, the mental or physical part of this game? Well, my mind is pretty strong. I, I don't feel any intimidation or anything like that. I'm, I'm actually more worried about just getting my physical self up. My mental is there. You know, I'm already in the garden right now fighting. So I, I'm, I'm excited about it. Now we just got to get in a little bit better shape. I'm in pretty good shape now as it is. So we, we're going to peak out and it's going to be a great night. Who takes some of the pressure off of you? Well, you know, I have a great support system. You know, I have my kids and my mom, fiance, Bob here. He helps take a lot of the stress off. And so I surround myself with a lot of good people. Okay, and just to, to end this weight-wise, how's the weight? Everything good? Yeah, my um, weight's fine. It's definitely good, fine? yeah. Okay, hey, good luck. Well, am I looking a little fat? Is that what you're no, you're looking good to me. <laughs> I'm just making sure. Champ, Thank is you. This, is Thank you, all Thank you all for coming out. You know, I got to thank everybody involved. I thank, you know, Golden Boy Promotion, Miguel Cotto Promotions, GCP. I want to thank Al Heyman for making this happen. I got to thank you guys, the fans. And then whether you're going for me or against me, this is the passion that you guys carry that's been making this, this, this sport thrive. And I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not scared of the adversity. I'm not worried about the crowd. I know y'all going to be out there full force, you know, carrying your champion. But I promise you, December 1st, there's going to be a new star, like he said. And December 1st, you guys are all going to see why I'm here and why I'm the champion. You know, and I got two things in this sport right now, my belt and my undefeated record. And I plan to keep both of those December 1st. God has made this path for me, so I thank, you, thank him. I got to give all credit to God for making this happen. But I'm going to take this opportunity with both hands, and I'm running with it. So thank you guys for coming out. And I got to thank Miguel Cotto. I got to thank Miguel Cotto for being the hungry fighter that he's always been and taking on the fighters myself. Uh, you know, it, it's very honorable to be on that list of people that Cotto's fought because if you know, he's fought the best. But it's going to be even better to be on that list of the people that's beating Cotto. So I'd like to be that one. God bless y'all.